Before I start this commentary off, I just want to let you guys know what is my class setup with the PDW57. As my attachments, I'm using Suppressor and Fast Mag, Perk 1, Lightweight Hardline, Perk 2, Toughness, Perk 3, Extreme Conditioning, Lethal Grenade, and Tactical Shock Charge. Hope you guys enjoyed. Without further ado, here's the commentary. What's going on, guys? It is your boy, the one, the only, Street Gamers TV. And today I'm bringing you guys a brand new series on my channel called The Gun Review. It's where I'm going over most, if not all, of the guns in Black Ops 2. I'm going to be talking about the damage, the accuracy, why I'm using the attachments that I'm using, and everything. What spots the guns are good in and what spots they're not. Today we're going over the PDW 57F as I pimp smack this guy across the face with my PDW. This gun is a beast, guys, I'm telling you. But let's get into the accuracy, damage, and how to use this weapon. Okay, first, guys, we're going to talk about what game modes you should not use this weapon in. You should not use this weapon in game modes like Domination and other game modes where you're capping objective. Why you don't want to use them in the game mode? Because when you're going, for instance, for a kill, there's lines of sight and head glitches people look for in domination and things like that and usually in domination people are trying to use assault rifles and pick it out with their head glitches if a pdw going is going up against a type 25 in a long range combat who do you think is going to win because their gun is way powerful than yours and their accuracy may even be better than yours now as i speak of accuracy the PDW is one of the most accurate SMGs in the game in my perspective, but we'll get to that in a minute. Right now we're going to talk about what game modes this gun is good to use in. The game modes I would use this gun in is Kill Confirmed, Team Deathmatch, and Multi-Team Game Modes. Reason being because People usually run and gun a lot in those game modes. In Team Deathmatch, people are running to get kills. In Kill Confirm, people are running to get kills and pick up tags. In Multi Team, they're just all havoc going around. Because in those game modes, you're running and gunning, other people's running and gunning, and you're going to win because you have the PDW. 57 also known as the pal <laughs> you have the pdw and you're listening to your boy the one the only street gamers tv you're listening to gun review so you're gonna outgun them with your pdw in their running gun situation but now that we talked about that let's talk about the damage that this gun has the damage now this is one of the second most powerful SMGs in the game in my perspective because it seems like it, the accuracy is so good once you get your sights on a person they're dead in less than one to two seconds now the first most powerful gun in the game to me is the MSMC and the second is a tie between the PDW and the Scorpion Evo those guns are tied and I may even do a review on the Scorpion Evo then you really will know who's the most powerful it's the gun review I'm going over everything that you need to know to be successful with the weapon that I am talking about. Now that we went over damage, let's go to accuracy. With all I gotta say 
PDW57 has to be, if not the most accurate, one of the most accurate weapons in this game. It seems like, like I said a minute ago, when you get your sights on them, it's over. You know what I'm saying? It's over. See, with the PDW57, it also helps with the little green, how should I say it? Uh, how should I say it? It's not really a laser, but you know the green thing I'm talking about on the sights. That also helps you to make your shot more accurate and all around the gun just has very good accuracy. When you aim with somebody, it just seems like they're dead. It's like you have the upper advantage because your gun is more most accurate. It's one of the most accurate SMGs in the game Black Ops 2. Now, speaking of accuracy, if you're one of the people who like to hit fire a lot, I would recommend going with the laser sight and the suppressor because with the suppressor you're silent with the laser you have more hip fire if you're a person who likes to hip fire and you're using the PDW who also has great aim down sight accuracy okay now talk about now let's talk about the attachments that I'm using on this weapon you see I'm using the fast mag and the suppressor I'm using a fast mag because in run a gun situations you need to reload your gun and be the best man and I'm using the suppressor because you're silent you can flank around enemies and you're just a beast so stay tuned for more Street Gamers TV gun reviews Cause if you listen to my gun reviews, you're gonna be the best, if not the greatest. Hope you guys enjoyed. It's been your boy, the one, the only, Street Gamer TV. Alright, y'all. Peace.